ก็เป็นสิ่งที่ได้มาจากพระสังฆราชองค์กรน,นะคะก็บันิสถานไว้ที่นี่ด้วยนะคะเราก็เลยให้ทุกท่านต้องสูญผ้าบังคับเลยนะคะใครสุ่งสั้นมาจะจับใส่หมดเลยนะคะ English for so English for so with this way Okay. 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 Because we have to go by the group as well, and coming to wear. And next one, please, no ding, no pet, no food allowed inside the museum. But by the way, it's okay. You can ding by the way, but not allowed inside the museum. Okay, are you ready to go inside? This way, please. Please make a line, only one line, and please show ticket to the staff that way. Thank you. Is it okay to show? No, ma'am. Maybe you have to go this way.
Just remind you about some regulations. If water, please put in your pocket or in your bag. And uh, no drones and no food inside. Thank you. Okay, this way, please. If you're thirsty, you can sit somewhere and drink, no problem. Okay, this way, please. This is a symbol of Thailand. This is a Garuda. Garuda, they're feeding the Naga. Garuda, they're feeding the Naga. And there is also Indonesian Airlines, Garuda Airlines. Garuda is a vehicle of the Vishnu, but this is not a temple, this is a museum. Contemporary art. Okay, follow us please. Because the sanctuary of truth is permanent here. No move, but I will move. Next way, this way. Please, 
Thank you, Ka. Good morning, Ka. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the sanctuary. The first, take the right hand, enjoy with the tour, Ka. Thank you. Beautiful days. Is it? different countries, different religion, education, but we are the same because we compact of four basic elements. We start with the most solid part, the earth. You can see through the animals, forests, mountains. In our bodies is a skin, the bones, the teeth and nails. Water, you can see through the waves and the sea plants. In our bodies is a blood, plasma, urine, sweat, tears. How about fire? When wife angry for husband, when husband, I'm not joking, joking. You can see two dragons, they breathe the fire. In our bodies is a body temperature, and two dragons breathe the fire. Body temperature, especially now, wherever you go, check your body temperature, right? And wind, how to show wind is the wood carving? It's not easy, but you can see moving trees and you can see swaying clothes. In our bodies is a breeze of life, oxygen. How many minutes people can live without breathing? 30 seconds, one minute, in Guinness book, 22 minutes, but people who are trained like divers. And I want to show you one more sculpture over there. Male and female, feminine and masculine. This one, Shiva and Parvati. Does this represent equality of the gender? project, all of these spaces, the wall, the ceiling, have to be cut with wood carving everywhere except the floor. And one more sculpture I show you, after we need to go to the another section. So this sculpture symbolizes the wisdom, and this sculpture symbolizes the ignorance. Wisdom and ignorance always matter. Civilized people who born on Friday. Wife of King Ramanai, she born on Friday. In Thailand, they celebrate Mother Day, 12 August. Saturday, who born on Saturday? Saturday, people who born on Saturday, they have big heart. They want to help everyone, but cannot. That's why they feel sad. But don't worry. 
One of the daughter of King Ramanai, she born on Saturday. We cannot say not happy or feel sad. Color is purple, same like your sticker. Yes, you said you're born on Saturday, right? Sticker, purple. That one is tiger. People who born on Saturday, planet is Saturn. Why is tiger? Is it to be angry and then come down? self-sufficiency, thinking how much we have before we spend.
in a positive. So for example, this is society full of iniquity, no justice. Two kind of bridges. This bridge was built with very good quality materials. A lot of engineers, this one for noble people. Bamboo bridge, they use less quality materials for poor people. Well, here is society and here. But we need to come this way, please. Come this way. How do this society of justice, how it's represent? This represent through the father, he share his property equally with his three kids. Daughter, son, the same. Society full of iniquity, society full of justice. Which one you want to live? Which one society you want to live? Justice or iniquity, okay? Next one example I want to show you, come this way. Next one, this way. We born, then we grow up, and we take from the nature, you can see the person, with a basket. We take, and we take, and we take, and one day nothing is left. Destroy the nature, for birds know her place to nest. And these are children, they have conflict with the parents. Children and parents have conflict. This is society full of gratitude. Disciple, he says thank you to his teacher. It's like a therapist, massage therapist. I don't know how much for massage, one hour, but uh, negotiate the price. <laughs> so this is a teacher, just a, a disciple and teacher. Taking care of the animals and plant the trees. This society full of dissonance. They try to build the bridge. Someone fell into the water. Nobody helped him. They angry at each other and their faces not friendly. Society full of dissonance. This is society full of harmony. Children and women cannot do heavy job, but they can prepare some food, they can bring some tools, and people from different beliefs, different philosophies can be in harmony because accept the difference. Now my question to you, what kind of society you want to leave for the next generation? Society like an outer columns or inner columns? Obviously an inner, but we cannot expect people be good to us. We will not start ourselves first. And every society starts with the family. Now we are going to explore truth number seven. We will come down to the smallest room. It's the it's smallest, but it's very meaningful. Okay, follow me please. Seven truths. Seven truths of life, Mr. Please. I will, we will come down, I will tell you one story, then we will come up again here, here for conclusion. But now we are coming down. Okay? Come down and tell you one story. This way. <laughs> So even, this is the smallest room, but it's very meaningful. And these sculptures represent not only biologically parents, but people who are taking care of us, like in family. Teach us how to sit, teach us how to stand, how to walk, how to run. I'll tell you one story. There was one boy, he liked to play with mango tree. One day passing by near mango tree, Mango tells, can you play with me? Boy replied, I don't have time. I need to buy a toy, I don't have money. So the mango tree said, I don't have money, but I have fruits. You can pick my fruits. Go to the market, sell them, you can have money, you can buy a toy. He did it and he gone. 
When he grow up, he passing by near mango tree again. Mango tree asks, can you play with me? Man replied, I don't have time. I need to buy, I need to build the house, but I don't have house. So the mango tree said, I don't have house, but I have branches. You can cut my branches and build house. So he cut the branches and he gone. There's only one piece of wood left, like a leftover. When he became an elderly person passing by, near the piece of wood, the piece of wood said, I don't have anything to give you. The elder man said, I don't need, I'm tired already, I just want to sit down, to relax. The piece of wood said, you can sit down here. As he realized this piece of wood, this mango tree, is the parents with their sacrificial love. And this is a picture of the founders of this project, Kulnek Viryapan, when he was a young man. And so Mm -hmm. And this is a picture of his wife, Kunprapa Viryapa. Both of them, they passed away 22 years ago at the age of 86. Nowadays, their son taking care of this project, he already over 70. When he visits this place, first he pays respect. And let us look at the ceiling. I want to show you life cycle. Picture number one, but hold on your family, please. Picture number one, parents give up birth. Number two, taking care of her. Two. Three, provide with education. Oh, teach us to be a good person. Please protect us when we're dangerous. Six, help us to find job, occupation. Seven, when we have our family. And eight, provide with the properties to be sure in our future. And the last one is a message of the founders three months before they pass away. But we need to go up for conclusion. Okay, I will give you some booklets. Okay.
Different place if you the trip inside. I'm not going inside. Though. Okay, thank you. Just outside, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so hot. <laughs>